And see, I had my hair pulled back. I had a lock. <laughs> no, I'm crazy. Mm. I had, I lost a lock. I got the bed, and I was like, what's that on the bed? It was one of my locks. And I'm like, where'd it come from? Yeah, I pulled, I think I pulled every piece of my hair <laughs> to see where that lock came from, and I could not see where the lock came from. So, I got my little crochet kit out. Uh, I had this, uh, one of my, one of my little edges, you know, cause finally they starting to try to grow. They trying to, um, um, stay locked. Cause you know, my perimeter is just, my hair is so soft. My perimeters, they've been, every time they slip, they come loose. So this one was holding about here. So I said, I'm going to take and attach my lock with my crochet kit. This is my first time attaching a lock. Now y'all know y'all have seen me do the um, bunching. This time I attached my lock y'all. It didn't come from this, from this lock, but I attached the lock to this and it made my edge thing longer. Look at there. Can y'all believe it? Look at this. <laughs> I can't believe it. Anyway, I left it out just so I can show y'all. And I remember it when I looked in the camera, but I will let y'all know on my lock journey, if y'all follow me on my lock journey, I'll let y'all know even more about this lock and, and if it's actually stayed. But look at there, y'all. I did it with the crochet. My very first attachment of my lock. Oh, I don't believe it. Anyway, I like I say, I don't know where it came from. I don't know where it came from in my head, but it came from nowhere. But it's back in my head again. So I attached it to a separate lock that actually needed it. Ooh, y'all. What's up with that? See y'all next video. Bye. Follow my lock journey. Y'all know where it is. Check out my playlist. You'll see it. Love you guys. All right. Lock update. I was in the process of getting ready to get my hair retightened. So I had to wash my hair and all that kind of stuff. So I figured, let me go ahead and take this lock that I had attached to my edge lock and just wait until after I get my hair retightened, that made sense, right? So that's what I did. So now you guys are gonna watch me crochet it back into my hair. Mmm. -hmm. All right, so this is the, this is the, um, the lock that had fell off of wherever it came from. And this is about, the piece that I'm attached to is about maybe two inches long. Let me find it right here. It's about two inches long. And I'm going to crochet it into my, back into my lock. Um, so yeah, y'all, just watch, 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 and watch. I'm going to be using the point zero five. I think the attachment is. I'm going to show you guys. You'll see it. I think it is the point zero point five. That's what it is. Zero point five. That's the smallest one that's in this kit. 0 0.5 hook and when you crochet the hook because I saw that on uh, YouTube <laughs> University <laughs> you take the hook part and you face it towards yourself as you're going in through and my daughter's in the background doing a little room cleaning <laughs> all right so I, I'm, I got the volume turned off on this I'll turn it back on in a few but right now I am going through that lock and I'm separating a little bit of the hair so that I can entwine it around the end of the um, small edge lock that I'm going to be putting it on. I am in no way a pro. I am just practicing this on my hair. And we're going to see trial and error how it turns out and if it works or not.
This is actually very relaxing. Now there's this one back here that's got a little knot in it. You see that knot? It's not a bunch, it's an, it's an actual knot. I don't know how it got in there, but it is a knot. So I'm gonna see if I can crochet it, this two together. Let's see if we can do that. doesn't seem to want to cooperate. Um, maybe I need to cut it. What do you think? Do you think I need to cut it? Oh, I think I'll work on it just a little bit longer. I think I'll work on it just a little bit longer. Let's try it again. Actually, These are, I've never used these right here. I'm gonna see what happens if I try to use. And these are a little bigger. These are the um, 0.75. And I'm gonna try and push them in a little closer. And hopefully not break them. Oh. Uh, can't really put them together. But let's see what we can do with these on that knot here. weaken it when I do that but I think I'm gonna cut it you need to cut it I think I'm gonna cut it yeah I'll be back I'm gonna get my scissors all right you guys so instead of cutting it I'm gonna try to opt to stitch it tight and 
Let's see if that'll work. I want to I want to try and salvage it if I can. Now I'm gonna get this right here and I'm gonna put it up here. This is when I just um, stitched up. That's that's the one I just crocheted up. Okay. Now I'm gonna get into this one right here. Where where you go? Where you go, boy? Where you go? Right here. Okay. So that little knot there. I remember I tried to uh, do a uh, sew uh, repair on my hair, and my daughter uh, said, oh, mama, do it. She was, I was gonna have her do it for me because I couldn't really see, you know, my right eye having like a, like a vision in it. And so I'm like, um, so she tried, and the next thing I know, she was cutting it, and she cut the whole lock off. <laughs> Try and bring this down here as close as I can. Mm. Let's see. All right, here we go, y'all. Right, here we go. So we don't get them put the needle. Oh, this is gonna be a little hard. No, maybe not. Let me just do this hair right here. Alright. Uh, Hold up. Kind of hard when you can't see it, especially when you're not used to doing this. Like this. With your like a vision. Oh. All right, there we go. Okay, so we're gonna put this through that piece of hair. We're gonna pull that string in. Come on, get close to the end. Where that string is. Okay, grab this hair. Y'all see that string, don't you? I need to see it though. There we go to where there's just one string. There we go. All right. Now, we're gonna go back in here. Uh-huh. I should have put my thimble on because I don't want to go in here and cut, stab my finger. I'm gonna come through here like this. so we can get that piece of hair wrapped in there. Alright you guys, so I'm going to snip this. I'll snip that right, y'all. Snip it and not snip my hair. How about that? There we go. Snip that thread off. Back on my this one. Let's pull it up a little 
big y'all okay see that that's a lot better that is a lot better yay now let's see if I can do this now yay Yay, you guys, I did it. Look at that. I did it. I did it, y'all. That hump, that, see, it's not coming up anymore. Yay. I can do it a little bit more. I'm so proud of myself. <sighs> but now I'm trying to get hot flashes, y'all. Don't know if I hot flashes. Oh, all right, Jesus, I'm missing. All right. There we go. We got it. It's repaired. Yay. <laughs> Sound of applause, y'all. Sound of applause. Now let's take everything down. My rubber band on my hip. These trusty rubber bands are now my bracelets, y'all. Right on my wrist. Back you up. Let me just take the hand through your hair. I will let it go and make it just don't care. You wanna do it? You wanna do it? Oh, it came out, y'all. Oh, it came out. I guess I was too rough. Mm. Well, you know what that means, right? It means we gotta start over. It means we gotta start over. You know what I should do? I should do, I should leave this in like this like that, and then crochet this hair. That's a brilliant idea, Shella. Okay. That's a brilliant idea. All right. Where you at, baby? Where you at? That's not you. This right here. Okay, here we go. All right, we just gonna snap you up there like that. All right, so now, we're not gonna use this in, probably because it's probably too teeny tiny. We're gonna use the end part. Let's get the loose hairs right here. Yay! Thank you for giving me that idea. Did y'all suggest that? And I don't know. Did y'all suggest that? Well, we're gonna try to salvage it. This is just practice, y'all. If, if I'm able to, to salvage it and keep it in my head, then I'm good. I'm good with that. I just gotta remember not to be rough, so rough to it. Mm -hmm. let, me, let me try the double one anyway. Let's see. Let me try the double one. See what happens. I tried that one. Okay, I felt it pull. Okay, so it was trying to get on there. All right, so let's bring it down a little closer. See if y'all can see it a little better. Maybe y'all can help me out here. Uh -huh. Maybe y'all can help me the sister out. So now I'm gonna take this right here, I'm gonna wrap a piece of this right here, I'm gonna wrap it around here. Like, like so. Let me put this down if I poke myself in the eye. Um, 
I decided to do the end part and put it connected instead of the, the top part. I realized that the other part was too thin because when I ran my hand through it, it came, it, it, I pulled it out, which I probably shouldn't have touched it, but you know, you live and learn, you live and learn. I did it like this, right here, right here. <laughs> yeah, baby. But I did do a stitch repair with a, with a piece of thread on, a, on another one that had like a knot in it and I wanted it more flatter so it wouldn't stop popping up. And I think I did that good. I think I did a good job. Stick with the small one. Stick with this one. What you think? I'm gonna go back to the lactation and she can be like, wow, girl, your, your hair, that piece grew so long. I'm like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> nah, I tell you, I, I did a repair, I did a self repair, that's what I did. Uh, uh, did a self repair with a loose hair pattern, that's what I did. I think. Yeah, you can get hmm? I don't know. I don't know. A lot of stuff in my hair just in these last few minutes, y'all. Well, you gotta do that. What y'all think? See that? Mm -hmm. And y'all see my edges? Oh, you can tell I got my new growth because 
My edges are coming back and they're coming back great. Coming back great. Hmm. So anyway, so I may have to use my um my um my edge control. Y'all remember my edge control, the color edge control? Remember I had one in black and one in brown, so I may have to use the one in brown to kind of like you know, cover up my grays. It's all up in here now. It's all up in there now too. Anyway, but as long as I keep my hair pulled down, it'll be no show. So. Now, then we'll do that. And there we go, you guys. See you guys in the next video. You know I post videos every day, so see you tomorrow. And don't forget, share, share, share. Like, 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 comment, 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 and subscribe. And I did it, y'all. Mm, I did it. Where is it at? I did it, y'all. I'll give y'all an update on how well it stayed. And if I had to go back in and crochet it some more. Bye. What's up, what's up, you guys? It's your girl, Shala and Frank. Come on over and check out our channel, Promo SDK Reality TV, husband and wife, where we eat good in the neighborhood. We're a mukbang eating show, cooking and recipes, especially soul food, pranks on Frank. Oh, y'all go check it out. Challenges, vlogs, comedy skits, short videos, and TikTok. So come on and become our oh yeah baby today. Subscribe to our channel. Follow us on Instagram, promo SDK, promo SDK. Or you can also go to any of our social sites and find us under promo STK. Oh yeah, baby. We can't wait to see you. We can't wait to meet you, so come on over.